Our research indicates. Welcome, welcome to my exquisite lair. <gasps> Dr. Dr. Tomoki! That's right! Where's Spectre? So sorry to disappoint. Mr. Spectre is no longer here. He's quite busy, you know. Well, no matter. In either event, your broadcasting station is finished. Yeah! No use resisting. We have you! <laughs> Just wait until you see what we have in store for you. The Spectre TV project that you two tried to stop was just the beginning. Our real plan begins now. Our real plan. None other than the Double Paradise Plan. While everyone is helpless from our Spectre TV, we will launch from our giant base in orbit around the Earth. A huge... Hold on there, Dr. Uh, Tomoki. That is quite enough. Oh, uh, right. Well, if it isn't, my dear friend, Mr. Spectre. Thank you for your advice, sir. Don't you think it's about time to take care of these meddling fools? Exquisite <laughs> idea. You just stay there and watch this. Indeed I will. Indeed. I'm so sorry. But your time is now up. Could this be the top of Tomoki Tower? Surprised. Hey! That's not fair! Yeah! You're in a robot! I need at least this much firepower to fight with you two. Or to look at it another way. I'm showing respect to you both for making it this far. Huh? It's from Aki! I thought that you two might be able to make good use of the robot and flying turtle about now. Use these in your fight. All right! Couldn't you have done that before, Aki? Been useful? I'm sorry, but your time is now up. Okay, so we have to go through the whole rewarp sequence. We had to go back for juice and cookies. Okay, so at least I have some experience fighting the guy. By the way, the robot respawns every time you... Wow, that was awesome. Uh, I could have done something drastic there. This thing is so annoying. How you jump? Like that, I suppose. Not really. What are you? What are you singing? Titan Luxury Beam! I don't know what the fuck the flying turtle does, but... I assume Yumi's piloting it. Where did she come from, anyway? for this I was on the monkey helmet research team with the professor then one day during an experiment an accident caused my head to well become like this that's what did it what led my life astray <laughs> go ahead laugh I know you want to oh you poor man <laughs> yeah <laughs> Don't laugh at him! Huh? 
<laughs> oh, leave me alone. Who couldn't laugh at that? You're horrible. Laughing at someone's pain? How would you feel if everyone laughed at you? Oh, forget it. My double paradise plan is still on. And it's not like you'll ever manage to reach me here. Hey, how does it feel to be so helpless, huh? Have fun sitting there sucking your thumbs. Hmm. Ciao. Au revoir. Spectre, I'm gonna... Uh, what are we going to do Don't now? Don't you worry. Huh? I'll help you. You will? But first, please shake my hand. Your kind words meant a lot to me. I will take you to Mr. Spectre's place. <laughs> Space Tomoki, Mark 1. Launch! Wait, is there some kind of vacuum ventilation or seal system that might be able to give us air before we get into orbit? To outer space? Wow! Look, you two. We can see it now. The moon? Look carefully. Behind the moon. What is it? It's huge. Spectre. You think the arm would have been... That's right! That's where Mr. Spectre is! Right there in Space Station Sato 3! Prepare for entry! Yeah, that's right. That's right. Spectre, how dare you laugh at him and the way he, his life went astray when he lost he, his hair. Because that's what drives a person insane, is the loss of their hair. You fucking idiot! You insensitive prick! How dare you laugh at someone's pain! Deep inside his heart, he loved his hair like he loved his mother. How could you laugh at such a pure man? I swear, on the on the depths of the Holy Grail, I will vanquish you! <laughs> Next time. <laughs> because I'm not going to play... I, 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 I'm not going to play the final level now. And you're not going to see a bit of it, because... Ugh, I'm assuming it's going to be even longer than the Tomoki stage. So, this is it for Ape Escape 3 now. <laughs> he, 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 he went insane because he lost his hair. You'd think the monkey helmet would have augmented his brain, and he would have been partially under Spectre's control, but, but no. No, it's just I lost my hair, so I went insane and made everyone dress up like friggin' Michael Jackson. I don't know. Good lord. Some people, I think he was just born with problems. Like, he really just needs to go out and maybe get laid. Aki would gladly do that. Okay, that's enough rambling. Next time, Spectre Saru 3, blah, blah, blah. Later.